Larry here. You know, I wasn't always the perfect physical specimen you see today. In fact, just last week, well... A uh... hundred and ninety. In my book, that's a fever, young man. Son, I'm sorry, but if you're no better by tomorrow, your Little League game is out. But I'm feeling better already. I'm... <coughs> How come Larry's so sick, Mom? There's a flu bug going around, Loopy. A flu bug? Like with six legs and big claws? I wanted to tell Loopy that influenza, otherwise known as the flu, was just a microscopic virus. But all I could say was... Achoo! Don't worry, Snot Sausage. Nurse Loopy will beat up that bug for you. Aha! My first clue! Soggy wads of flu bug flotsam. Gee, nice neighborhood. Phew, you scared me, big fella. I thought you were the... Hey, you! Come back here! Somebody's cranky. I am not. <laughs> All right, I am. But I don't feel good. <laughs> you poor thing. <laughs> oh, what do you care? Nobody likes having the flu. Well, maybe not the vomit launch variety, but sometimes it ain't so bad. You don't have to go to school, and your parents have to wait on your hand and foot. Really? <laughs> know what I think? You've been working too hard. Why don't you get out of this chilly old town for a while and take a vacation? Somewhere warm, mm -hmm. tropical, healthy. You know, that sounds like just what the doctor ordered. Thanks, pal. So that's the story, according to Loopy. But bug or no bug, the very next morning my flu was gone. It's a medical miracle. Hop to it, son. You're gonna be late for your game. Excuse me, folks. Package for Nurse Loopy. Hi, pal! I, I'm in beach bug heaven. P.S. Enclosed is a token of my appreciation. Might come in handy next time you want a day off school. <laughs> uh, 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 a chew! Hi, Larry here. You know, there comes a time in every kid's life when he takes that first step into adulthood. And for me, the big moment came last Thursday night. Larry, your father and I have something to tell you. Son, you're getting to be quite the young man now. And we think you're ready to handle the most exciting privilege the adult world has to offer. Late night television! Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. I, I won't disappoint you. They grow up so fast. Well, I should have known Loopy wasn't going to take this situation lying down. No fair! How come Larry gets to stay up late and watch all the cool stuff? Don't worry, Loopy. Your time will come soon enough. But right now, it's bedtime. So this was it. 52,000 channels of fiber optic fantasy were about to be mine and mine alone. One small step for mankind. One giant leap for me. Welcome to the Chess Channel. We're only 18 hours in the semifinals, Mitch. 
and already the excitement is at a fever pitch. What's this junk doing on late night TV? Must be some kind of mistake. Did you know that millions of Americans are troubled by excess ear fat? If you're one of them, then you owe it to your ears to try the Lobalizer. <laughs> Ugh. Gotta stay awake. Gotta... And in today's stock market news, the average share index showed a remarkable upswing in the overall down cycle. Hey you! This ain't late night television, it's lame night television! Seems like we have a cranky couch potato out there. Let's see if she still feels that way after experiencing late night television in person! Woohoo! Hey there, welcome to Hanging with the Hangster. Say, you're kind of short for a celebrity, aren't you? <laughs> Put it out, you canned corn balls. If this is quality television, then I'm a Brussels sprout. Brussels sprout? Wait a second, let's see your mature viewer ID card, little lady. I don't have one. <gasps> Warning, underage viewer. Grab her, you idiot. Hey, come back here. Last show on the dial. I've got you now. Larry! Wake up, you warm head! Larry! <laughs> Get me out of here! Loopy? What's going on? What are you doing on TV? Tell you later. Just call in and buy me quick! Hi, uh, I guess I want to buy a doll. The, the funny-looking one. You do? Okay, fine. The bill's in the mail, mister. Thanks, Larry. Hey, I didn't know you had all that money. I don't. I've only got 50 cents. So that's the story. I guess I was hoping that late-night TV would open the door to a whole new future. But thanks to Loopy, I got a little more than I bargained for. Hey, Mr. Home Shopping. When you're done with that, you can sweep the garage, clean out the gutters, and re-roof the house. Don't worry, kids. You'll have that bill paid off by the time you're 21. Hey, Larry here. You know, when it comes to thrills, there are two things that top my list. The martial arts, and the Charlie Chicken Show. Plan 9 from outer space. So imagine how I felt last Thursday night. It's like chicken heads. The annual Charlie Chicken Road Show is coming to your town. Don't miss Kung Fu Chickens on Ice. I spent the next two days studying the ancient art of Kluk Fu. And becoming one with my inner chicken. Kluk, Kluk, Kluk. Now nothing could stop me from having the entertainment experience of a lifetime. Nothing except... Larry, I think it would be nice if you took Loopy with you to the show tomorrow. I offered a convincing argument. But Mom had made up her mind. If I went, Loopy had to go, too. Woohoo! Which brought up an interesting question. How can you achieve chicken nirvana when your sister's got the attention span of a soap dish? When's it gonna start, Larry? Are there gonna be any monster trucks? Hey, I'm hungry! Think they have any chili popcorn? Listen here, you tag-along twerp. Ladies and gentlemen, put your wings together and give a big cock a doodle -doo. For Charlie Chicken and Turkey Thompson. Enough of the hooey. Let's see some cotton booey. <laughs> hey, that's no way to treat a paying customer. And now the moment you've all been waiting 
four. The master will now demonstrate the martial art of Kluck Fu. And to assist him, he will require a volunteer from the audience. Me, 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 pick me over here. I'm your number one fan. Me, me, me. Hey, Bird Brain, look what you did to my dress. How about that cute little girl with a ponytail? Splatter my Sunday best, will he? I'll give that cluck something to squawk about. Here, kid. Hurry up and hold this. Hi! Yeah! Oh, no. Okay, your martial arts menace. Prepare yourself for chicken stance with drumstick kick. Leap and loopy with messy dress. <laughs> I have it with you, kid. Five fingered foul of fury! Oops. He's out cold. It's frozen solid. I knew he shouldn't have done the show on ice. I couldn't believe it. The biggest day of my life had been sabotaged by my own sister. This is a disaster. How are we gonna finish the show? Don't get your stuff in all steamed up, Turkey. I know somebody who knows all the moves. He's crazy for Cluck Fu. He's Charlie's number one fan. He's my brother Larry. And that's when I realized that all those hours in front of the TV had actually paid off. Because two minutes later, I was out there skating in the master's footsteps. It was a dream come true. And it was all thanks to my number one fan. My sister, Luffy. 